Hey friends, it's me Jenny here today with another t-shirt cutting tutorial. In this video we're going to transform this little t-shirt into a racerback style. First I cut the neckline, the sleeves, and the bottom seam of the shirt. Then I fold it in half so I can cut down the front of the shirt. Then I fold it again so I can cut little slits all the way down the back. I just eyeball it, but a lot of people like to use chalk or markers. After I cut the first row of slits down the back, then I fold it in half again and proceed to cut two sets of slits on either side of the middle. And then I do the same thing to the other side. This is when I took a minute to announce my DIY video filming on Instagram Live. Recently they announced Instagram TV, which I find to be interesting. After I'm done cutting slits down the back of the shirt, I like to stretch out the fabric a little bit. I'm always really careful to warn people not to cut through the wrong side of fabric, but Right here is a perfect example of me making that very mistake. This is when I decided to make this shirt a racerback tank top. Improvising is key when making a shirt like this because you never know when things aren't going to turn out how you planned. So all I did was cut off the top half of either side and I left the slits down the middle the way they were. So this shirt has these super wide sleeves, which is fine because it's summertime and I'm trying to make new fashions for the pool, the beach, outdoor activities, for like over a bathing suit, while I'm hula hooping at a music festivals or whatever. And this is what it looks like in the end. Ta-da! There it is! I love compiling videos in playlists of tutorials for cool t-shirt ideas as well as collect images that I find inspiring on Pinterest, so feel free to stay in touch. I'm on Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, all that good stuff. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye friends!